What's up everyone, Trey Thousand GT here with another video. Uh, this time we're looking at the Nike Air Jordan 5 Retro from 2006 in White Sport Royal Stealth. Uh, this colorway, this is the first time we saw this colorway. Uh, didn't come out uh, back in 1990. Um, major thing with these is the, uh, the reflective material on the tongue is uh, not as uh, reflective as the 2000 version. Uh, also, they uh, they didn't use the uh, the OG air units. These are the uh, environmentally friendly ones. And the tumbled leather on here. I'm not sure if you can make out that this is tumbled leather in the video, but it is. It's uh, it's a lot more stiff than the uh, the tumbled leather that was used on the uh, Laney's, the Laney fives back in 2000. So. But uh, all around, these uh, these fit true to size, and they're super comfortable, so no issues there. They do start to yellow if you don't take care of them properly. Uh, a lot of these pairs just came pre-yellowed in certain areas, and uh, came with the lace locks, this jump man hang tag. I mean, this I don't know about some of you guys, but... Uh, kind of uh, looks weird because these tags used to say Nike Air on them not used to seeing the Jumpman logo on there so but uh, you can tell that this this is very stiff just look how it creases now for all you guys that have Laney's uh, Laney 5's pull them out and you'll feel that the padding right here is nice and soft it's like spongy these are just like stiff like there's just nothing in between here. it's just the uh, cotton liner and this stiff uh, tumbled leather. See that? So it's definitely cheaper than the uh, 2000 version. So, but uh, still comfortable. Nice colorway, and uh, it's a newer colorway. So um. Price range on these, I'd say anywhere from maybe from uh, 200 to 315, uh, depending on size and condition. And uh, that's really it. Uh, if you guys have any questions, concerns, or comments, feel free to drop me a line. And as always, stay tuned for more videos.